and my niggas trying to get it, you bitch. We got a shop, but dude. <laughs> so if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen by now that me and Stefan collectively have probably bought about 17 shops in the last couple weeks. We have finally came to the right one. So it's a pretty big unit. This is a big upgrade from the storage unit that we filmed a couple videos in with the gray car. The new shop, kind of. We still got a lot of construction that's going on in here. So if I didn't break that door, we'd have a door right here. This is going to be my office where I do a lot of the computer shit. We're probably going to have a zip line that shoots across there gonna be a bunch of parts storage because if you don't know by now i sell bmw parts on shopwebbies.com that's what i do then right here walls wall tv couch bitches we're gonna go downstairs it's crazy to say downstairs at my shop well, obviously when we bought this shop there was nothing in it but some oil stains that we had to clean up and a very dirty bathroom that we gave the webby special to look out it's close to being done. A nice place to take a shit. This is gonna be where all the cars get worked on. And it came with lifts. So for all my jack boys, we're leaving you. I'm sorry. My New Year's resolution this year is to stop jacking. So we got lifts. Why in real life is about 5'2". I, I just, no. <laughs> so I know a lot of videos, we're usually treating these cars crazy and breaking a lot of them. But I promise you, my customer cars are not treated the same. Anything from turbo kits to oil changes. I promise you I can do it all. Hit up your boys. Do not call this number for late night tech. Services only please or do if you're a female that's my phone number <laughs> All right, so we're running late as shit for roll racing at the track, but Stefan turned up his uh, LS to 11 pounds, I think it is. He's never turned it up. It's always been on wastegate, so he probably has a chance of beating me in a race now. With the black car, we got Alcantara interior trim, which looks sweet, but we're running super late, so we got to hurry up and get there. fellow non-existent legit as soon as i said we have no problem <laughs> hey but we got the happy day trim now. yeah can't complain got this <laughs> we're already late as f but i need my mirror cap i just put them on oh well, i see it it's in the grass is this no u turns so i do it anyways everybody hide your ladies we got a bad man <laughs> on the road <laughs> Woo! Feeling good on she was humming that time right there Never be on time to anything. Never. Oh, we got it. Come on. <laughs> All right, like it never happened. Come on. What was that? I have no idea. Literally, as soon as I pull up, I'm gonna have to hop on the track because we're so late. That's just what we're doing. 40 rolls. It's no speed limit. Are you ready to go? You ready? Yeah, like 22. kidding car's done i don't even know what happened i think i don't know just got the car working good again yesterday it's the end of the drag strip it kicked out real bad everything looks together there's no oil anywhere i should have known not to race it because it's literally 92 degrees outside and i was like F it, we still gonna roll race now we're at the end of the drag strip i got every code bmw could ever think of no power steering ls swap time look gmw you finally blow this thing up <laughs> It's not getting fuel. Well, this is what it's came to. Travis pulling me. Should've swapped it. Should've swapped it. Might be the DME because there's a lot of DME codes and electrical codes and I got a lot of wires sitting by the turbo. So a dead ass just might be that I mounted a wire. And I'm really close to Travis, so I hope he doesn't hit the brakes and I rear end him. <laughs> really close after non-stop google and heat strokes we look at every single fuse possible ding dong the dme fuse blue we stuck it on the car trailer to take it back because we didn't have a fuse old trusty auto zone had some fuses let's pray that this was the problem because i mean the fuse was blown I'm gonna title this video, How to Brick an E92. I swear to God, I can't ever keep this car running. I just throw money in it, and it's just a whore. We were checking the glove box, and look at these fuses. I'm surprised my car's not on fire right now. Is that, that's f***ed. We haven't driven. 
We haven't driven it since, but I think we're gonna be all right now. I think she's good. I mean, it doesn't say my doors are open for no reason anymore. Send that bitch. Better let her know you see how. Why are they at the window? <laughs> Where did this come from? Hey, if my car's smoking, I smoke too now. That's how it goes. <laughs> we turned her up a little bit. She's at 29. I think this is when it breaks again. We put those 29 PSI fuses in there, so we should be all right. 29 pounds to the dome. We are about to see what she's got. This man's gonna put something else to his dome when it misfires. I'm not his mechanic. <laughs> Bro, it held. Damn. What the f okay, look, I told you that 29 pound fuses, baby. She's moving. Dude, what the f Hey, I'm his mechanic. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. That's the first time it's ever held that much. Where's the PTRs at? <laughs> hey, you're talking crazy. This is why it's working now. Flame Dude Turbo Air Fresheners live now. Yes! Yo, she's moving, I'm not gonna lie. She's Whoa. moving. It's holding. Go map three. Go map three. Turn it up. All right. <laughs> Turn it up. Goodbye, motor. It's been a fucking good time. Oh my god, bro. We're literally about to go see the moon. NASA hasn't been there yet, but Webby's just getting there. Hey, yo. Oh my god. Everyone says, why is, why is cars broken all the time? Not today. It does break every video. I fix it every video too, so. It still smokes. I don't know what the problem is. I think I'm just gonna keep it at 30 PSI and daily drive it until it blows up. All right, now we're gonna go to the, the slow car, and I don't know why I have a cigarette in my hand, but I do. I found it from a homeless man. <laughs> What do we got going on here? My windows aren't wired in yet, bro. This is some mad science and shit. I have no idea what's going on. We're working up jump cables to some bare wire. Hey, I got my window down somehow. Put the window up, man. Uh, <laughs> That's a pretty normal way to roll down a window. That's uh, normal as it gets. That was quick and easy. Couldn't be any quicker. Hey, I'll let you guys know. Why the f***ing begged me to bring this car out? <laughs> Show them the street right now. It's wet. <laughs> slicks in the rain, baby. And these are slick slicks, because they're about wore out. Whoa. It does not hook right now. Wait, turn, the, turn the AC on. Right, thanks. You want to listen to some music while we're at the red light? Yeah, here. Turn the wipers on. Cash only. We can get a fry. <laughs> Can't hear what they're saying. Yo. Shawty. <laughs> Welcome to Wink. How you doing, man? Have Just one. Down. You got bad reception. Broke the intercom. You want to give me a call back? I just have one small fry. Okay, your turn will be 275. First window with the lights. Sliced potatoes? I give him a small fry for free. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> they don't like the camera. Yeah. All right, now let's go give this to a crackhead. Yo! You want some french fries? You want some french fries? They're brand new. Oh, oh, I appreciate man. it. I gotta say, I'm impressed about how much shit you wired into this one switch. I gotta turn off the rear end. All right. Good man. You need to unlock your doors? Nope, All thanks. Right. <laughs> I promise we're gonna give fries to a crackhead. So, here you go. Oh, man. Fuck a pigeonhole, I'm a night out. It's a different